The U.S. sanction on Iran will come into effect from Monday tomorrow. Remember that U.S. has uh, exempted eight countries from sanctions. Now, the Trump administration said that eight importing countries, including India, would temporarily be allowed to keep buying Iranian oil when sanctions come into effect. Now, Iran is the world's number three oil exporter. Washington reintroduced sanctions against Iran in August after the U.S. pulled out of a multinational 2015 deal that lifted sanctions in return for limits on Iran's nuclear program. The EU, France, Germany and Britain, who are parties to the nuclear agreement and trying to keep it alive, said they regretted Washington's decision to reimpose sanctions. The EU is creating a special mechanism that would circumvent U.S. financial sanctions on Iran. All U.S. nuclear-related sanctions will be in full force by early November. They will be in full force. After that, the United States will pursue additional sanctions, tougher than ever before, to counter the entire range of Iran's malign conduct. Any individual or entity who fails to comply with these sanctions will face severe consequences. I ask all members of the Security Council to work with the United States to ensure the Iranian regime changes its behavior and never acquires a nuclear bomb. Now, Tehran says it has complied fully with the nuclear accord and its commitment has been repeatedly confirmed by the UN Atomic Watchdog, the International Atomic Energy Agency. سیزده آبان روز مقصر بودن و جانی بودن آمریکا در تاریخ بوده امسال هم باز همونه سیزده آبان به معنای یک ظلم جدید از طرف آمریکایی هاست ولی ملت ما در همه مواقف استادگی کرده در این سیزده آبان هم استادگی خواهد کرد مردم با قاطعیت بدونن که نه دولت از این تهدیدات آمریکا حراسی داره ممکنه ما بر حال تو چند ماه گذشته یه مقداری بر مردم ما سخت گذشته چند ماه آینده هم ممکنه بر مردم ما سخت بگذره اما دولت همه توان خودش رو خواهد گذاشت برای اینکه این مشکلات رو بکاهه دولت آمریکا و اقتدار و هیمنه آمریکا در دنیا رو به افول و رو به زباله در طول سالها هی داره کم میشه آمریکای امروز از آمریکای چهل سال قبل که انقلاب پیروز شد به مراتب ضعیفتر قدرت آمریکا رو به افول این نکته مهم اینه